it's the ego on all of the individuals who are not operating at their best potential who are operating actually at very substandard levels bare minimums motherfuckers beyond that at least i instead of at most i you feel me it's the ego on these individuals that's preventing them it's the ego on you motherfucker that's preventing you from really being on that level that you truly honor and respect whatever you are your world is yours listen you have to become the individual that you actually look in the mirror and be like, yo, fuck yeah. You feel me? You gotta look at your life and be like, yo, look at what I've created, right? Because until you actually create the life that you would like to live, you have to acknowledge that underneath that rock is the fact that you're not living the life that you wanna live. And how do you expect to feel living a life as a person existing as you do not wish to be? You'll never feel free, you'll never have the clarity, you'll never have the power, you'll never have the peace. So most people get on these videos and see my, my, my messages and they'll assume it's all about a workout. No, it's not about no goddamn workout, but the workout is just as important as anything because the thing about the spiritual community at this point, the spirituals and all these people with all this higher consciousness, shut the fuck up. You don't do shit but talk other knowledge that you haven't even thought about yourself. That you just heard on the internet that everybody at this point fucking knows. But nobody's living it. And we can see that you're not living it. And you just want to seem smart. But at the end of the day, we can feel how you feel under your skin. Because energy recognizes energy. And vibration is the only information we actually need. So when I walk into a room at this point, because my frequency is so tuned up, because I'm so keyed up and living in honesty and living in alignment, it already, you can feel the atmosphere shift and so much energy drawn towards an individual like myself. And when I do see an individual like myself that I can recognize because energy recognize energy, real recognize real, aligned recognize aligned, I always give that person respect. Like, yo, I see you, ah, 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 boom, boom, boom. No hate, straight appreciate, you feel me? But yeah, back to what we were saying. When we walk into a room at that elevated state, at that state that we've created for ourselves, as that individual who is in fully aligned, in alignment, what happens is so much energy gets drawn towards you. Why? Because everybody can now feel how much bullshit they're actually living. Now you need to have the vessel that can even maintain that level of attention and, 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 and projection. You feel me? Because my teacher says, if people that don't reflect, they project. When people don't reflect, they project. And that's what happens. You're gonna have people when you're fucking amazing, and a lot of y'all are afraid to be fucking amazing because people are gonna start to project on you. But you need to, I need to, consistently stand in this motherfucking energy and make sure y'all start to elevate because ain't nobody trying to backpedal on nothing you out here with a gut mad that i got a six pack when i could get you a six pack why homie you could just be like yo bro can you put me on the real motherfuckers in this world like myself i see things that i admire i see individuals crushing shit i'm like yo how you do that please put me on yo that's fire hey teach me right y'all got the ego that's what we saying it's all ego that's, com that's leaving you committed to living a life you don't want to live, existing as you don't want to exist, seeing other motherfuckers possess qualities that you like, and now you hating instead of elevating. Whatever you are, your world is yours. You have to wake the fuck up. Now, you might not be a crazy-ass hater watching this video, but you definitely probably a bullshitting motherfucker out here who's not living in alignment with their vision. We need the body that we love and respect. We need the mindset that we love and respect. We need the emotional clarity and emotional fucking fortitude that we fucking respect, AKA be sober enough to embrace life, raw dog this motherfucker and level up internally. We need the inner and the outer. We need it all. As within, so without, as above, so below. That means as below, so above, motherfucker. Y'all be talking this shit, but y'all don't be living nothing. You feel me? Whatever you are, your world is yours. Shiggy Shig is literally probably the one of the rarest entities in this world and if you decide to get on the program one the blueprint for the workouts that shit is nothing can you adhere to the vision can you not quit 
you're gonna be ripped you're gonna be jacked it's that simple you do this you do that this is what happens it's one plus one on that level but we need to get you to really understand and fully embody that higher level of consciousness right and truly integrate that into your life why do you like your world is your self-mastery is the only success evolution is the only solution and we need to see the results why do you like your world is yours you have to drop the ego i love this shit right now oh my god I love this shit right now. This is why I be outside in the cold while you motherfuckers be laid up with these bitches. Y'all don't even got no bitches. A lot of y'all ain't got no bitches. Hold on. Y'all just be laid up, crying in the crib, depressed, mad at motherfuckers like me standing out here looking like motherfucking warriors from the ancient times. Like I said, man, evolution is the only solution. You have to let go of the ego in order that you can evo. You have to see that the person who's fat as fuck has the biggest fucking ego because you're trying to force feed us that bullshit. The person who's out here on drugs thinking that shit is wavy even though they know dying, they're dying inside. They're fucking feeling like a fucking slave. Every time they say they're going to stop, they don't and then they lose their self-esteem. Their biggest fucking ego. 